Eyewitness News begins with breaking news. And that breaking news comes from just off Port Fouchon in the Gulf tonight. During this evening's heavy storms, a lift boat capsized. There were more than a dozen people on board at that time, and we do know that the Coast Guard is out on the water for search and rescue at this hour. We saw a lot of reports of wind over 100 miles an hour during the storms tonight, making it very dangerous for those on the water. And our Paul Dudley is live in Port Fouchon tonight with the latest on what happened. Paul, what have, what have you learned? Well, Katie, this 256-foot uh, commercial lift boat, boat capsized during an afternoon of severe weather just south of Grand Isle that we're still really experiencing right now. It is very windy. Uh, it, was, it is believed that 18 people were on board, and we just learned that six of those 18 have been recovered. Now, we are at what is uh, the staging area here for the Coast Guard and some local rescue officials uh, very close to Port Fouchon. We just saw a number of firefighters also. So somebody out here told us that an ambulance uh, was seen leaving this area. Also on Highway 1, just driving in here, we saw uh, a number of ambulances as well. Now, this all started this afternoon about seven nautical miles offshore from Port Fushan. This video here was posted publicly to Facebook, and it shows the Coast Guard cutter there and the capsized boat on some really, really rough waters. Now, we know that the U.S. Coast Guard and several Good Samaritan vessels responded and worked to rescue those on board. And it looks like six of the 18 have been recovered at last check, but the search does continue. The boat is called the Seacor Power, and according to the website marinetraffic.com, it left Port Fouchon today at about 2.12 p.m., and it appears that it ran into trouble around 3.30. That is when its last position was noted there on the chart. Uh, so we are following this situation very closely. We have been in touch with the Coast Guard. The search does continue out here, again, like we we told you we saw a number of uh, firefighter personnel, rescue officials here, and several ambulances as we were driving on Highway 1. Just a little bit more about this boat. We know that it is port in New Orleans, and as far as this rescue is concerned, the U.S. Coast Guard in Houston has confirmed that assets from Texas are on their way to help in this rescue as well. So a very active situation still going on here in Port Fouchon. Live in Port Fouchon, Paul Dudley, Eyewitness News, back to you. All right, Paul, before we let you go, when you say those six people have been recovered, are they okay? You know, that, that was a question I had myself. Uh, when, when we got this information, we got the words recovered. So we're not totally sure if that means rescued or recovered exactly yet, but still lots of questions for the Coast Guard as this uh, rescue does continue. Okay, Paul, something to clarify in the future. Thank you so much.